ID checks and restricted campus access. These are just some of the changes you'll see at Chuan University. I felt safe because the front door is the only way we can get in now. And the only people who can get in is the ones with IDs. Administration stepping up security after a shooting and armed robbery happened on campus within a week of one another. Both incidents leaving students shaken. I knew probably one or two, and they told me that they almost got hit by a bullet. Could have been me out there. Until further notice, students will only be allowed to enter through the front doors of residence halls. These signs reminding students that side doors are now for emergency exits only. I would love for us to be back going through the side doors, but only for the safety, I can't beat that. Campus-wide visitation is now also limited from 3 p.m. to midnight. Desk workers will be monitoring who comes in and out and signing guests in. In addition to what's being done at the residence halls, the university is also going to have more officers patrolling different areas like here at White's Crossing. It is cops going around at night with flashlights, making sure students on campus, not just random people going in and out like it used to be. And students will need to have their ID on them if they want access to the student center at night or on weekends. University officials tell News 3 that these changes come after the recent crimes. They say students, staff, and faculty are the highest priority. I feel like the safety has been better. In Hertford County, Aaron Miller, News 3.